Our mother in law was an inspiring soul, always there for us who came to her with her, their troubles, with kind words and wise advice. Her home was open to everyone and her hospitality made us feel important. She was most lovely, humble, compassionate, understanding, hardworking, fearlessly independent, brave-hearted woman, and one of the most beautiful souls that one could ever meet. She always considers all of her children. Mother, you are the truest, dearest, more than a mother to all of us. You held the mentor for, for years after your husband passed on 17 years back and only God knows the inner soul you had to portray to fit in his shoes. You are our source of strength. We saw you fighting bravely when you got admitted in hospitals a number of times until you could no longer hold it. Finally, you gave your hand to God, sipping away quietly in the wee hours of the morning when the roll call was called in the morning and in the place in heaven. It was in the morning when the roll call was being called. She was just about to take her tea, her breakfast, and then she had a name being called Lois Wambura Edwin. And she said, Lord, here I am. Eh? We, had, we, we have no doubt that you went straight to heaven and you are having the best time with angels in paradise. You are a precious gift from God, so much beauty, grace, love, and patience. Passionate. You touched our hearts in so many ways. Your smile, even on dark days, made us realize we had an angel besides us. We know you will continue to be our garden angel. We are going to miss you every day of our lives. Rest assured, we loved you. May your soul rest in peace. Amen. I will only say one word about her. She was a great lady. When her husband fell sick, she came with her to my house in Nairobi. And she told me that... Uh, I have come with him. Adeito siaku. Kinyamude nyawa kwa muisho. Nedio ka oko kumuona. Na me akewe tatu dai kadira na mude. Ne atige ira fororioyo. Kedo kena ne mono. Gide mutiero ohara wa inoro. Na royal media. The Mutuene are he get one a moi. The Ramoya, they go near the Gimono King, a foreign secretary, a US, a he go away. Nedi Moaho, they there. A Kajera, Diego, a Camusi, to carry a dinner. Hare a gong road. The Mura di Woka. Eh, the Niagadia Kera Mude. Ule adoiga, ake ruo je ruo die, ake jera mudoniwa, mudo te shoka geri ya kera uni uguo, udie todo de muoyo udie ni udie kuwe tiro, na mudo ahe oke do ne mune ne, ya lega ga ne kuweo ya ga, no do kari. Eh, how? 
Moitekia, the dear Qua Moy, Moya Kajera Rosio, or Roca Kuhigua Station Yaku. The Murian Enka, the Wasi CK with Yamaroa, a Kajera Sanini Munene, the Kiomuana Royal Media Coro. But to me, a way, ha ha. Dare Hiremu de Wakwa. Moto, what a nam brain bigger than all of us, probably. Eh, the ticket in a royal media. Kogwo, the tail the other. No, the tail the other, the other family. He had a mutumio first hand gift for the new Utomaga Utomate had to assure the Mabenevita out of raw media a benefit. Ego Tora, I did a canago for those words. His name, thank you. Uh, good afternoon. Uh, sorry, but I'm MC. I'm going to interfere with the protocol a bit, just for one minute. Uh, I'm calling Dr. Litunya. I come from Kakamega. And with us, normally when you go to such a place, we are accompanied by people. So I can never leave this place without introducing those people I came with right now. Uh, wale watu walitoka na mimi kakamega tafadhali semameni what we just wave to those are my brothers uh, sister and uh, nephews nieces and others thank you very much now as we have seen this family is large quite large and united I found it very difficult, honestly, to penetrate in this uh, family and be one of them. And when I joined, of course, I made it larger. I remember when I was uh, having the sister or the daughter of uh, uh, Marehemo, she took me around the, to, her, to introduce me to her brothers, sisters, uncles. The list was not ending. Thank God, most of them were from Kirinyaga, so uh, it was not difficult to visit them. Most of them welcomed me very well, though a few of them, again, there were some mamas that Paris, uh, you want to get married to a lawyer? Take care. That lawyer must be having a wife already at home. And if he doesn't have, uh, he will marry one. I remember I was being told that even Mweshimiwa by then, Robinson Kidai was a young lawyer. I was told he positioned even somebody in Kerugoya to track me down, to find out what type of person I am, whether I'm a playboy or somebody who can marry his sister. Uh, thank God I believe the report he got from whoever he, he put there was in my favor. Why I say it must have been in my favor that time was uh, during Jero's wedding, I had not joined the family. I had not joined the family, but uh, my wife was one of the, she was in the bridal group. Uh, I think I was the happiest man in Kerugoya town when a young lady came to see me fully dressed in the wedding regalia. She never even waited for that uh, wedding to be over. Then that is the time I knew I'm succeeding to penetrate in that. <laughs> yeah. Jeru, then I, I kept on asking myself that uh, my friend Jeru now, how did you try to uh, position somebody without my knowledge? Okay, I didn't know anyway. I didn't know. I should have taken you to court without, because you, you had somebody <laughs> to track on me without the uh, consent from the court. Now, uh...